Hi everyone, I'm Sundari Nye. Welcome back to Let's Play Breath of Fire 2. Just a quick note, when you're walking while you're walking out of the cave, the uh, Joker Gang's cave, remember there was a guard that was blocking a treasure chest and said that you can't have it. Well, make sure to pick up that treasure chest before you leave. <laughs> because the guard's not there anymore. And it holds a thousand coins, which is a really big boost to cash right now. So make sure to grab that on your way out. Also, something of note. As I was on the way out, fought a couple more willows. They're weak to reuse silver dagger if you get the silver dagger. They'll take a good 60 plus from it. Uh, they'll take a lot of damage, basically. So... That'll help as well. Now we're on our way to uh, Windia. As you can see, Nina's basic attack really doesn't do much. She's a spellcaster. <laughs> to to a T, she doesn't have a lot of uh, a lot of physical attack power. Ryu does though. <laughs> You'll face some new enemies on the way. Now. I stocked up on herbs. You're gonna want them. You'll want some antidotes as well. Because you're gonna start coming up against enemies that poison. Let's see, where exactly is what I'm looking for? It's a little bit of a journey. Ow. Great! Thanks for both of you hitting Nina. Grumble, grumble. Did you this counterattack? These enemies are tough. They're stronger than your typical... Typical enemies. That we've fought so far. The counterattack is annoying. Unfortunately, Nina won't get EXP from this, which is what I want her to get, is EXP. Oh yeah, she's knocked out. Great. We shouldn't be that far, though. Get across this bridge. And then I'm going to be taking some time off screen to level up Nina and everybody else because these these fights aren't as aren't as easy as you can tell. These uh, sniper heads, snipe heads, are going to do what you just saw. They're going to power up and then hit for a lot of damage. Try to take them out as quickly as possible. You don't want them to have too many turns. Okay. Hello. You may not enter. Hmm? Oh, Mina! Thank you for your hard work. May I pass? Uh, of course. A maze starts here to keep invaders away. Please proceed with caution. And he's right, there is a maze. You can't see exactly where, where you're going. Hello. I once took care of a princess in this castle. This princess was exiled because she had black wings, which people thought were a bad omen. But the king did not do this because he wanted to protect her. I know the secret, but as you can see, I no longer have the strength to get out of this bed. But in comparison to the sadness of the king, this is nothing. Black wings, huh? Bad omen. Yeah, put two and two together. <laughs> Nina, everyone will be shocked when we return, won't they? Yeah, they'll, they'll be real shocked. Oh. According to legend, a person with black wings will ruin Windia. Oh, is that a fact? Well... As you can see, that sheds a little more light onto why good old Nina here 
probably won't be welcomed. Now this maze is a little mazish. I wish you could come home every once in a while. Sounds like Nina really isn't welcome. Nope, that wasn't right. <laughs> You'll just have to keep going through doors until you find your way. It's not that difficult of a maze. It could just be a little time consuming. Once you find the stairs up, you're out! Who are you? I had my sister bring me back here. I don't know anything about that. Mina does not have an older sister. Yeah, nobody likes you either. Mother? I'm sorry. Your princess seemed to have been lost, so we... Sis, what are you saying? Your Majesty, what is this? It seems these people saved Mina. Take them curious... Uh, Curtis... <laughs> Curtisly. Take them nicely. And escort them out of the castle. Blah, blah. My tongue fails. Mina, you must also thank them. Mother, what are you saying? Sis? We cannot let just anyone into the castle. The best way to get to the Eastland is to cross the cliff to the south, where the distance between the cliffs is not great. And we're kicked out. We can't let just anyone into the castle. And like I said, the best way to get to the Eastland is to cross the cliff to the south, where the distance between the cliffs is not great. What? Why? Why? Wasn't Nina a princess? Tell me why. What is it about the black wings? I'm sorry. I made you feel uncomfortable. Not at all. I think your black wings are really beautiful. Thank you. So, because of the whole bad omen with the black wings, Nina is shunned at her own country, which is just really sad. It's because because she's different because apparently she's gonna bring some horrible omen when you could probably guess just the opposite will be true. Huh, who are you? Come and see, it's a novel magic show. Uh, okay, sure. I'll put someone in this perfectly ordinary box. I'll make it disappear with my powers. Well, well, mister. Won't you take the challenge? Uh... Wh Why does everybody just drag Ryu around like they own him? I mean, come on! <laughs> Show us your courage! You don't want to look chicken in front of the cute lady! Well, that's true. I don't want to look bad in front of me. Or, not me. Nina. Okay! We're all ready? Here we go! There, a pause, please. Mm. Hey, you! Where'd you put Ryu? Ah, well, that is. Never mind the magic. Please just bring Ryu back. Is Ryu your boyfriend? Not yet. Uh, I mean. No! But bring Ryu back. It's difficult for me to say this, but the magic trick was a failure. He has disappeared into another dimension. Well, that's not good. So, Nina is now the main character. I apologize. What the heck is that? I don't get it. Are you saying you can't help him? Well, it's not that I can't. It's a long story. Shall we have some tea and I can explain it to you? You crafty monkey. No, thank you. Now, bring Ryu back. Mm. You 
see, I'm a bachelor too. <laughs> Stop, you talk too much. Nina, let's just leave this guy. Uh, Nina, let's just leave this guy and find Ryu ourselves. Sorry, I forgot who was talking. Don't get mad, little girl. I'll help you find Ryu after my date with Nina. Or I can punch your lights out. Or will you play with me? I really don't mind which you, of you I have a date with. Shut up, Shen. Sten, sorry. Shen. <laughs> Wait a minute. I think I want a date with both of you. If you refuse, Ryu will not be saved. Uh huh? Whack! Cat likes to, uh, to hit people with the stick, if you haven't noticed. Another dimension, huh? You flirt. Ryu's right there. How dare you try to fool us? Big swing! Look, well, ready? Got the home run swing ready. Get lost! Oh no! Oh, save me! Oh, that's a loss of one stock for Sten. Forgive me. I seem to always get carried away when I see pretty ladies. I'll behave from now on. Forget it. it doesn't matter. Ryu's back and safe. What? You're gonna forgive me? You're so kind! You're just as I thought you would be. Huh? You're so kind to forgive an idiot like me. May I call you boss? Now what are you plotting? Nonsense! Please, let me serve you. Huh? Uh. Ready for the swing again? <laughs> if you don't knock it off, I'll punch you! I'm not kidding! I'll give my life to you. Wow. Alright. Follow us, Sten. Cool. And Sten joined the group. After a very just random scene, we get Sten. Yay, so, okay, let's uh take let's take inventory of the party. So we have Nina who's like banished from her own country, but she's really cool. And if you know anything about Breath of Fire anything about the lore she'll end up falling in love with Ryu it's a it's a thing so you have that going you have Kat who's completely loyal to Ryu and you have Sten who's completely loyal to Kat so there we go <laughs> now we have Sten Sten's interesting Sten is Sten and that's all I can all I can really say we'll get more into Sten later uh, he knows Spark, which is a single, single hit. Now, what I recommend doing is you're going to need to level up Nina and Sten. And it won't hurt to have Ryu and Kat have a few extra levels as well. Now, something I will show you about this place. There's a dragon statue to save. Uh, weapon shop, weapon shop. The item shop has new things as well, but there's the inn, which isn't marked, which is weird, but that is the inn. Ah, weapon shop. Okay. Something I want to show you about Wendy. Welcome to the armory. Wendy's gear is expensive. <laughs> We uh, weapon for magicians. You'll want this. There's the uh, glass RG. Again, it gets confusing because it RG because it has the same name as this. But you'll want this for Nina. Maybe a long sword for Ryu. It does have two more attack power. But I believe there are enemies that are weak to the silver dagger, uh, such as undead enemies. I think are weak to it. The willows were for sure. So, uh. I may stick with the Silver Dagger and save myself 620. That's... that's Or I may buy the Long Sword and just switch between them. But, anyway, the Long Sword's there if you want it. Weapon worn on fist. Revit knuckles. Nobody can use those. Uh, a knife with a short blade. You have this dagger. Actually, I'll buy the Long Sword for Ryu. Because I think Sten can use this Silver Dagger. That's probably what I'll do. So there you go. 
You'll want chainmail for Cat Ryu and Sten. You'll want the holy robe for Nina. Uh, the helmets all the way around. And bronze shields for Ryu and Sten. So there you go. There's a lot to buy. But you're going to be out getting some EXP anyway. Plus, all my cash is stored in the bank. What I suggest is go out and get a few levels, especially for Nina and Sten. You want them to probably be at least double digits. I would guess... Oh, you'll want a couple of levels just because you saw how hard the enemies are. Probably 11, 12-ish is where you'll want the party as a whole. You can use the money from that time and then take whatever else out of the bank and buy new equipment. You'll want the equipment here because it does help a lot that the stat boost. I'll also show off the item store. There's the bank on the right as always. You have her, you have herbs, which I'll buy an extra one to replace the one I used. A uh, helpful bowl or bottle or whatever it's supposed to be, which heal 100 hit points. These were back in Corsair. Same thing with the wisdom fruit, the antidote, vitamin, uh, teardrop, life pill, and smoke. So it's the same shop as in Corsair. I thought there was something new here, but my mistake. Again, you'll want herbs, and you'll want antidotes. And you'll want a healthy stock of both, because... That's how you're going to heal. Nobody has really curing spells. I mean, Ryu does, but he can cast Cure 1 four times, and that's it. So, keep that in mind. Herbs are really going to be your way to heal. Uh, go ahead and save. And where you can level up is just right outside of here. And here are the stairs up. Wendy is called the town that leads to the sky. Just so you know. <laughs> so I'll show you a little bit of what you can expect here. You'll just want to fight around here. There's another circus tent, which doesn't really have anything, just like the last circus tent we were at. Now, Sten's special move is RIP. Rip, or rest in peace. Sten will play dead and make it to where the enemies more than likely will not attack him. Something of note, don't use, don't use uh, R.I.P. when he's alone. <laughs> it's just a, uh, I don't know if it's a bug in the game or something that, that was programmed, I don't know. But Stan will take a ton of damage if he's alone in the party, so. I see Stan not the best damage, but he doesn't really have a great weapon either. He's a spellcaster-ish. Sten just does a, a, a little bit of everything, it feels like to me. 260 experience, 36 coins. You do get a lot of experience, not too many coins, sadly, but uh, Sten is useful outside of battle. Lead off attack. Here you'll also find K-Goblins, which I think are King Goblins. That's why I always thought of the mass. Now, also that's the other thing that's not really helping Sten is he's in the quote back row, unquote. Because Cat's in the front row with three. So, he doesn't do as much damage, I believe. Uh, Nina's level 9. Nina learns agility down, so you can slow enemies. Kind of nice. Um, useful against really fast... Really fast enemies, but... Uh, not as useful as it is in some other games. Now, here's an enemy you need to watch out for. Death Peak. The reason for that is Death Pete is one of those that can. There it is, Poison Breath! Death Pete has a chance to poison every single party member. It's. very, very nasty. Yeah, counterattack. 
so you'll want to get rid of Death Beat as quickly as possible. This is really annoying because that takes money. Because now you have to either rest at the end, uh, 256 uh, EXP, 50 coins, or use antidotes, which take money. It all, all goes back to money. Because <laughs> you don't have a spell to get rid of it, and that's what's really annoying about this part. That you really should have some type of healer at this point, but you don't. Now, we just got 50 coins. See, you still have poison, but you don't take poison damage while in town. Poison racks up damage quickly. You just walk around. Now, the hotel here costs 30 coins. The inn. Stink at the end will get rid of poison, but that's 30 less coins. Now, antidotes are 12 apiece, so you could use two antidotes that save you six coins. Just use it depending on your MP situation. So, what I'm going to do, this will be kind of a short video, shorter than normal. So, I'm going to end this video here. What I'm going to do off screen is I'm going to try to get money, and I'm going to get... Uh, levels for Ryu and Sten. This is something you just need to do because with new party members they're going to come under leveled for the area which is a, a sad fact. Yeah, you really need them stronger. Plus you're going to need the gear from Windia so you're going to have to get coins. I hope you st you got the thousand from the arena you got the thousand from the Joker gang hideout that'll help you a lot and you've saved your money up to this point. You've just bought herbs, antidotes, and the equipment when you can. You can't even sell something like the Luck Candy just uh, to get a, a lot of cash. You get like 50 from it. There's really not a great way to get money. You're just going to have to fight and get what you can. Like I said, you'll get a little bit while you're... While you're... Uh, while you're just getting EXP for the party members. You're probably going to have to prioritize what gear you want. If you got the Silver Dagger, so you can make Sten respectable, pick a respectable, because I believe you can, uh, he can use the Silver Dagger. And to test that really quick, I'm going to go ahead and pull out some money. And you'll want to do this a lot. You'll want to bank as much money as you can. You're going to need it. Uh, nut store. I need... I believe it was 6.30. Hope I remembered that right. And this is just why money is so important in Breath of the Wild. Why dying really hurts. Losing half of the cash. Oh, 620. Okay. We're going to buy a longsword for Ryu to use. Stint can use the Silver Dagger, and it gives him 10 more attack power, which he can use. So, go ahead and, and do that. That'll save you some money. That way you don't have to buy the dagger from in here, because it's not as good as the Silver Dagger, if I remember right. Yeah, it's not. So, that'll save you 290 zenny if you were going to buy the longsword anyway. And we don't need this. So, there we go. So, like I said, in between episodes, this will happen quite a bit for, for a while, if you can't tell in Breath of Fire. Or Breath of Fire 2, I should say. Breath of Fire 2. You really do have to get the characters level up and grind money it's a pain but it's it's part of it and that's the wrong shot <laughs> so I'll show you the levels kind of everybody's HP 
and I'll do the shopping on screen so you can see what I bought. Store the rest of the money. So, until then, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you had a lot of fun. We got a new party member. We learned some backstory with Nina, what's going on here, and kind of know our, new, our next destination, but we have quite a bit to do before that. So, such as shopping. <laughs> so, until then, I'm Cinderay9. Remember to shoot for the stars and take care, everyone.